Hi, Mark Waldman here. I wanted to talk to you today about uh, swimming pools and, uh, and some of the maintenance you can do at the end of the pool season as we head into the fall. Pools are uh, coming out of uh, commission and uh, whereas there's the two primary components are the structural elements of the pool, the pool liner and the deck, uh, there's also the, the, the mechanical systems. Today we wanted to focus specifically on the, the structural elements which is the pool liner and the plaster finish and the, the pool deck. Um, as a general rule you can tell whether the, the finish uh, in the swimming pool is um, wearing out and, and again with regard to the structure I'm speaking specifically about concrete pools uh, and plaster finishes. There are uh, a number of other uh, finishes that uh, or liners that pools can have, but the majority of commercial pools are are made of a concrete structure with plaster uh, lining. And you can tell if there's a lot of staining, uh, chipping, uh, what is commonly referred to as um, uh, calcification on the pool, or if people are fraying their suits and um, scraping their feet on the bottom of the pool and there's a lot of sharp edges, that's a general indication that the liner of the pool is at the end of its useful life. And uh, there are essentially two approaches to take uh, in rejuvenating the, the finish. If in fact there aren't substantial leaks or structural cracks in the, in the liner, you can uh, replaster the pool using a Portland cement and uh, marble um, uh, quartz um, uh, aggregate. Uh, that's the, the makeup of the, of the plaster itself. And that involves a preparation of uh, acid etching the existing plaster, uh, removing any loose material, and then reapplying uh, the plaster. The other option is to use an epoxy paint. Uh, again, if, uh, if it's just to rejuvenate the finish on the pool, you can uh, clean the, the existing plaster coating with the trisodium phosphate, which is a degreaser and uh, takes the dirt off of the finish and then acid etch etching the uh, remaining substrate and um, uh, applying a primer and then two coats of epoxy. Finally, um, the, the pool deck is also a critical area of the swimming pool which um, sadly you can lose a lot of water uh, through the surface of if the joints aren't sealed properly or if there's a lot of cracking and damage on the uh, deck itself. Most of the pool decks uh, on concrete pools are themselves made of concrete and uh, if sections of the concrete deck are removed, uh, the important thing to remember is that they have to be rebonded to the electrical uh, bonding of the rest of the swimming pool, otherwise there's an electrical potential that could result in a shock or uh, electrocution to uh, users of the pool. So it's, a, it's critical and important and the um, local and state health departments will require that you have this equal potential study done as part of the repair to the pool deck. I hope this information is uh, helpful to you. Thanks for joining me.